here is the front of 2724 Southeast 70th and then there is this driveway and I'm gonna have to check on how much is of that carport belongs to this house versus the other house here's the street nice houses on the street I was just chatting with the next-door neighbors and they seem very nice and here's the driveway and garage on this end so here's the aluminum siding and there are areas where it's um, the colors faded and stuff where I think it could handle a coat of paint And the door automatically locks, so FYI. So walk in, and there is a narrow coat closet. And then to the left is the living room. We've got oak floors, nice picture molding, new double pane windows in here, built in shelves. A wood burning fireplace, although actually it's gas. Um, here's the get the key for the gas. So it's got a nice feel in this uh, living room area. It's all arch. And then uh, we've got the stairs here to go up. And we've got a dining room area here. And then in the kitchen, we've got vinyl flooring. Uh, we've got a refrigerator, dishwasher. Um, basically, I think original cabinets, that, which were probably oak and are painted. Uh, it looks like we do have garbage disposal, electric cooktop, and a recirculating fan. Lots of counter space and cabinet space microwave here and um here is the remote this is a little interesting i think it was a built-in one before and they took it out so they basically have this microwave on this tray um let me bring you to the garage next so out back here got a patio area, lawn area, they've got an area for a garden, and then a shed with some compost bins. Um, let me open the garage. So single car garage with electric, it's got some storage, um, smells pretty dry, it looks like it had uh, shingles down, so if you ever need to redo the roof in here, most likely you're going to pull those off, um, but it looks like a decent garage. And the roof on the garage does look a little bit older. It looks like it's missing some of its granules and stuff. Um, it is flat, but it, you know, it just looks like maybe someone has power washed it when they've cleaned it, which is not, not the good way to go. The next door neighbor said the back door was unlocked, so I'm just making sure it's locked. Um, okay, so first, let's go upstairs. So we've got carpet on the stairs. And we've got two closets at the top. 
And then here is what it looks like is the oak floor throughout up here. And it looks like it's in good shape on this side. It's a little worn in that one area where it could handle being um, refinished. As a rental, I'd probably leave it with carpet for as long as you can. And I had pulled up the carpet on one of these areas. Here's the floor here. So here's bedroom number one, which is a good sized bedroom, three windows, um, good head height. I'll try to see where I, oh, maybe it was this corner. Yeah, so I was able to pull it back and see that it is uh, that oak under there as well, which is really nice. Um, but this carpet's in decent shape, too. There's a couple areas that are bare like this. Um, here's the roof from up here. So the roof on the house looks newer than the roof on the garage. The roof on the house looks good. Here's the bathroom up here. We've got a skylight, nice deep tub, tile surround. It's kind of uh, arched here, but um, there looks like there's plenty of head height, especially because there's the cutout for the skylight. Toilet, newer vanity, tile floor. And then bedroom number two. They have it staged with a queen. Is this a queen or a king? I think it's a queen size bed. It's a pretty big bed. Um, and then here is the closet here. Again, the oak floors. So nice size of rooms up here in good condition. I'd probably leave it as is, unless you want to pull off the carpet now and just have the wood floors like this, and then you can refinish them down the road when you go to sell or something. So the half bath so I'm back in the um, kitchen and then the half bath remember I said there's a little uh, a little landing and then here is the half bathroom so it's tiny we've got a small sink here toilet here so it is not a big bathroom and then straight ahead another closet and then going down the stairs, here is that fuse panel that I saw. So it says, well, this is where it's written before. I think the um, home inspector will be able to kind of figure this out. The other agent said he pulled them out and some of the basement lights went off. So we don't have too steep of a stairs here. Now we don't have a railing, and that may be something called out. And then we have looks to be kind of a parquet laminate down here. So here's the room I was talking about as a family room. It's got a couple windows that are not legal egress windows. It has the um, parquet tile floor, um, finished ceiling, light fixture. It does have this plumbing stuff coming through here, which I think is for that half bath. And then it has extra storage over here. Smells dry. So we've got some closet, some shelves. And then this is hanging. Another closet. Stairs again. And then over to the unfinished utility room area. So we've got the washer dryer. Uh, we've got a high efficiency gas furnace. We have got a gas water heater, which we're gonna need to ask them to put earthquake straps on before the appraisal. We've got copper plumbing from what I can see. We've got copper plumbing over here, copper plumbing there, so that's good. And then here is the newer panel. Which is a 100 amp panel. 
It says laundry, furnace, dryer. So, um, and then it looks like there used to be another panel here, but this one's screwed closed. So I'll have the inspector certainly look at that. Again, it smells dry. Um, we've got uh, basically kind of a storage room uh, in here. Foundation looks good. Looks like a good solid little house. It's nice, even like the doorknob for the storage area is the glass knob. And then here are the stairs going up, so not too steep or anything. So nice neighborhood, good sized kitchen, really cute living room, nice wood floors, good sized bedrooms upstairs. Um, I think it'll make a great rental when you go to sell. You'll be doing things like, you know, changing out the countertops and stuff in here. It does have a smaller dishwasher. Is that a dishwasher? Oh, oh no, there is the dishwasher. It's a trash compactor. That's fine. I haven't seen one of those in a while. Yeah, here's the dishwasher. So that is it. And the paint looks like to be in good condition and stuff too. So not really anything you need to do before renting it. I'll take some photos too so you have those um, for your rental photos.